Dear ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video with nautical navigation theory basics. Today, I will explain the concept of marine currents, the continuous movement of seawater across our planet's surface. Currents can significantly influence a ship's navigation, accelerate movement over ground, decelerate it, and create difference between ship's course and course over ground. It's crucial for navigators to understand ocean currents to effectively plan and carry out navigation. Marine currents are driven by a variety of forces, creating a dynamic system that influences climate, marine life, and navigation. Let's explore the key factors behind these powerful movements. 1. Gravitational influence of the Moon The Moon's gravitational pull on Earth's waters is a primary force behind the formation of marine currents. This pull creates tidal bulges, areas where the sea level rises due to the moon's gravity. Interestingly, there's a second bulge on the Earth's opposite side formed by centrifugal forces. As Earth rotates, these bulges move around the globe, generating tides and contributing to ocean currents. 2. Interactions with continental shelves. Continental shelves and land masses also significantly influence marine currents. When tidal bulges encounter these shallower areas, water flow can be redirected, altering current patterns. The shape of ocean basins and the presence of continents are crucial in determining current directions and strengths. 3. Temperature and salinity. Differences in water. Temperature and salinity affect water density, creating gradients that drive water movement. Colder, saltier water is denser and tends to sink while warmer, less salty water rises. This process contributes to the global conveyor belt, a complex system of deep and surface currents circulating worldwide. 4. Wind. Surface winds play a role in shaping marine currents, especially in enclosed or semi-enclosed bodies of water. While in the open ocean, winds complement the moon's gravitational effects in closed basins like seas and lakes, wind is dominant force in currents direction formation. In closed basins, water masses have no space to move. The influence of these factors varies depending on the geographic context. In open oceans, the moon's gravitational pull is the main driver of currents. However, in closed basins, atmospheric winds take precedence, shaping the currents more directly. Understanding marine currents is essential for navigators, ecologists, and climate scientists alike. These currents distribute heat, nutrients, and organisms across the globe, playing a vital role in Earth's environmental systems. In practical navigation, information about currents, in particular trading area, can be found in nautical charts, sailing directions, and weather forecasts. Local currents should be always taken into consideration during navigation. Thank you for watching this video. Appreciate your support. Stay tuned. Bye.